Start. These folks joining us now, they're off to a good one. A group of young professionals coming together to bring people together. They have a mission and a goal, and now they got a platform. The young professional, black professionals of St. Louis, they meet once a month, and they're growing. Joining us to share more about the movement are Teron White and Raven Whitener. Thank you for joining us, T. White and Raven. How you doing this What's morning? What's going on? What's going on? How you doing? Man, we are glad to have you guys here this morning. We're glad about what you guys are doing. What made you guys decide to create YBP? Man, so uh, last year we were at... Uh, the Salute the Leaders uh, mm -hmm. Excellence Awards. Uh, Raven works for St. Louis American. Mm -hmm. So uh, me, uh, Raven Whitener, uh, Darius Harris, mm -hmm. and Christopher, uh, Christopher Miller mm -hmm. came together. There are uh, other two members of the organization came together and said, hey, we need to do something for St. Louis to get young professionals together to network mm -hmm. uh, and just come together once a month, you know, and branch out and do different things. So. Um, yeah, and then it was born. We yeah. we sat together, we came up with a name, mm -hmm. and it was born from there. And we were like, well, you know, because people want a space where they're not having to go to the club or right. going right. to, you know, have to be turned up. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank right. you. Right. 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 Yes. So you know. it's a nice opportunity for young professionals to get together with like-minded people, yeah. you know, understand where they're coming from on a nice weeknight. Not too late, not too much, you know, just to come hang out yeah. and have a good time. You know, come fresh off of work. Yeah, yes. suit, tie. And know. these are people who are professionals. Yes. And we can find all the turning up in right. St. Louis yeah. that we want. Yeah. But why is it important for people like you and people who look like us to have these type of positive events? Um, I think it's important because you need that space, yeah. you know, and you need to be able to relate to people that understand what struggles you might be feeling or ways to progress, you know, because sometimes those doors of opportunity are not always opened for us yeah. um, and so to have those connections to expand your network and um, you know your connections is very important when you're young and coming up young and coming <laughs> up but that's good because you're bringing people with like-minded ideas yeah. and goals together yeah so what is the uh, the mission overall of YBP ultimately it's to bring like-minded young professionals together to mm -hmm. have a safe space to connect and build their personal network and their professional network and you guys aren't just using this as a platform to network you're doing this for community involvement what oh, type yeah. of involvement you guys got coming oh up? yeah so uh, July 21st mm -hmm. we'll be at uh, Carousel Health's back to school health fair okay. uh, volunteering some time for that at 24 25 Whittier mm -hmm. uh, from 10 to 2 uh, back in December we did uh, teamed up with Big Brother Big Sisters mm -hmm. Uh, with uh, Robert Hughes over there in business development um, at Prime 55, so we did a back-to-school drive, mm -hmm. you know, gave back coats, toys, and stuff like that to Big Brothers Big Sisters. So uh, we're working on youth summits, uh, scholarship programs. So we're looking for sponsorships, you know, to give scholarships to, you know, young, you know, young students coming out, mm -hmm. coming out of high school, going to college, and stuff like that, and maybe help them pay for some books or some, you know, school supplies and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, I mean, we're just trying to give back where we can. Uh, and like Raven said, you know get some young professionals together, entrepreneurs, you know, whether you're a barber, you know, whether you're in corporate America, you know, come together once a month, mm -hmm. have a good time. Just be doing something positive. Just, just do right. something positive in St. Louis, yeah, yeah. But, so yeah. Those, for those at home who are just now learning about this because you guys are growing, meeting once a sure. month, where can people find more information? You can catch us on Instagram at uh, YBP underscore STL. You can also email us if you have any uh, information or, I mean, want any information, mm -hmm. uh, YBPSTL at gmail.com. Uh, also, July 25th, mm -hmm. we do have our once a month networking social coming up. Okay. Uh, we're doing that at Up Bar from 6 to 9. Uh, each month we do a different, a different event each month. And what we try to do is we try to present St. Louis with something different, you know, mm -hmm. uh, different gyms and hidden gyms in St. Louis. Mm -hmm. So um, each month we try to do it at a different location, uh, like I said, to explore and get out and see different things in St. Louis that, you know, different event spaces that, you know, we don't see on normal, regular, so. And we're also celebrating our one year at one this year. event. Yeah, so we've yeah. been, been one year. <laughs> we've been established for a year now, it's so we're very year. excited yeah. to rebrand and continue to grow. Yeah, yeah, we've grown. I mean, we, the first one that was at Whiskey, Whiskey on Washington, mm -hmm. we maybe had about 30, you know, um, people young come, black yeah, <laughs> young black professionals come out. And now we're growing to almost over 200. So Man, that's a yeah. beautiful thing. Yeah. We like what you yeah. guys are doing. We we'll continue to support yeah. it as well. We're going to have this full interview on our website, foxtv.com. Make sure you check out the Young Black Professionals of St. Louis, T. White, Raven. Appreciate you guys joining us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. We are back with more Foxy News after the break.